there, Skipper! We got him, Skipper. commit his body to the deep, looking to the general resurrection in the last day, and the life of the world to come, and to his second coming in glorious majesty to judge the world. The sea shall give up her dead, and the corruptible bodies of those who sleep in him shall be changed, and made like unto his glorious body, according to the mighty workings whereby he is able to subdue all things unto himself. Secure the detail. Aye, sir. Admiral. Let's get below. So our friend Captain Kruger was mortal after all. Of course. You had to be. What are you putting in your report? Exactly what happened. We sighted the sunken hulk of a German World War I submarine. We picked a survivor out of the water who tried to convince us he was the ghost of the submarine's commander. He was shot, resisting arrest, and given proper burial at sea. End of report. End of Captain Kruger. Fine. Well, I, uh, I hope things get back to normal now. Why shouldn't they? Uh, keep on course to Pearl Harbor on the United Lab if you need me. All right, sir. Captain Kruger. 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 My name is Lonnie. You have not finished with Captain Kruger. He will come to see you again. No. No, he's, he's dead. He's buried at sea. He will return. He will return. He will return. <laughs> Who's there? Who's there? to you with a warning, Admiral. Captain Kruger will return. He has not changed his mind. He intends to take over the body of your Captain Crane. He will again try to force you to shoot your friend. Do not listen to him when he comes. Close your mind against his thoughts. Close your mind against his thoughts. Close your mind against his thoughts. Close your mind against his thoughts.
Well done. Well, I don't see anything, Admiral. Nothing at all. Oh, there's some indication of nervous tension produced by strain and overwork, but nothing serious. Oh, will this uh, nervous tension be enough to induce hallucinations? Why do you ask? Well, I have reason to believe that I've been hearing things that weren't there. Well, I can't honestly say there are any symptoms serious enough for that. Perhaps you've been having nightmares. Uh, yeah, perhaps. Thanks, Doctor. Try to relax him. Hmm? Here's tomorrow's duty, Roster Lee. Very well, Post. You have Kowalski on starboard watch. Is he fit for duty? The doc certified him. He said putting him back on duty is the best thing for him. Very well, Post it. Aye, aye, sir. I want to talk to you before you turn in. All right. But not here. In my cabin. Chip. I'm worried about the Admiral. I don't know how close he may be to the breaking point. Now stay close to the intercom, just in case I need you. All right. I might as well warn you in advance. I'm not going to like what I have to tell you. Well, suppose you let me hear what it is first. A Grex submarine we sighted just before we picked Kruger out of the water. The U-444, a German World War I submarine sunk in 1918. Our nose camera got the shot of it. Why are you telling me this? I know the sub was there. We destroyed it with a missile. I sent a wire to the German Admiralty. And they not only sent me the name of the U-boat's commander, but also a radio photo of him taken in 1917. There it is. It looks like Kruger. But that was 60 years ago. He'd be nearly 100 now. Yet we saw him. We talked with him. We rescued someone who looks exactly like this man. That's all. I wish I could believe that. Well, I do. Admiral, he's gone. We can forget him. I'm not so sure that he's gone. This, uh, this thing's becoming an obsession with you. Kruger is coming back. I'm certain of it. Well, we'll, uh... We'll uh, talk about it tomorrow. You uh, get some rest. Oh, don't do it! Let us stay here and listen to what I have to say. Just, just for a few days. No matter what happens, don't let me have it. Or, or any other gun aboard the ship. I want your word on that. You've got it. Hey, Stu. What's the matter? You, uh, been picking up anything on your board? No. Are you? Not a thing. Okay, then what of it? What's the matter? That's what I'd like to know. You feel all right, Ski? No, I don't. I'll tell you why. I got this feeling that something's going to happen.
thanks, Admiral, for a very touching burial at sea. You are a stubborn man, but so am I. You have the gun. My terms remain the same. Shoot Crane and no one else will be harmed. Refuse and every man on your submarine will be killed. Yourself and Crane included. I won't do it. You will do it! I was cheated of my life. Cut down like a young tree. I will not be cheated longer. But why this ship? And why Crane? To feel warm blood in my veins. My world is here in these islands. My love is here. My life. I mean to have those things. All of them. It begins with the body of your captain. I will have his body. Now. We'll see. Master Arms. Master Arms. Master Arms. Master Arms. We will indeed see Admiral. Is it running? Sonar just went dead. It just went dead. But the owner just went out too, sir. Sir, keel unit's completely inoperative. Control unit is out. Amarack fading, sir. We're not going to be able to hold trim. Engineering. It's no use. Engineering. Engineering. Stand We're going down, Lee. We're going down. Thank <laughs> you. 
Feels like the air is back, huh? Yeah. Manustations. Manustations. Low main ballast tanks. Low main ballast. Aye, aye, sir. Full elevation and all planes. Full elevation and all planes. Low main ballast. Everything's under control, so we're back up to 110 feet. Level off at 90 and keep it there. Aye, sir. What happened, Lee? That's what I want to find out. Order engineering to make a complete check, fore and aft. Aye, aye. Skipper, we checked everything. Absolutely no reason for what happened. You find out anything more? Nothing. in the control room. Emergency in the control room. On the double, Doc. On the double. Get away. Get away. Still alive. Barely. He's in deep shock. Will he live? Will he? I'll do everything I can. Now, I've got to ask all of you to leave immediately. Everyone out, please. I'll be in the control room. I want to report in this condition every five yes. minutes. Yes, yes, but out quickly, please. Get the oxygen in here as fast as you can. Die. Doc, look, I'm, I'm all right now. I, I swear it to you. Right. Now, will you get me out of this? Yes. We'll see. After you've calmed down. Look, I'm calm now. Will you, will you take these straps off me? Admiral, you've got to keep quiet. I've got a man with a bullet in. I've got to get it out. Now, just relax. Kruger. No. Doc, Doc, Kruger's here! 
here. He's right here in the room with us. Will you turn around and look? Look, Doc. It's Kruger. No. Oh, he's still there. Will you, will you look again? Doc. Doc, he's still there. Believe me. I will you look behind you? Keep quiet. No. I just this will help. Look, I don't want it. I don't help. want it. Now breathe. Deep. No, no, no. <coughs> I don't want it. No, breathe. No, no. I've got to keep going. This will help. Just relax, relax now. Easy, easy. Breathe deeply. Easy, easy. Deeply now. Breathe deeply. Quiet. Just relax, relax now. That's good. That's good. Doug. Doug, look. Doug, Doug, look. Is he, Doctor? Captain, you've got to lie down. Take your hands off me. You've got to rest. Please. Captain, you've got a bullet in you. At any moment, you're liable. I'm fine. I'm going to the control room. No, I can't permit that. That's an order. Captain! Take care of the... Take care of the Admiral. Captain! Lee. The doctor said it wasn't as serious as he thought. You're not hurt? I'm all right. I'm fine. Well, shouldn't you be... I tell you, Chip, I'm all right. The sooner we forget about what happened, the better. Chip, we've got to put the Admiral under arrest for attempted murder. I'd rather you take care of it. All right, sir. Master at arms... Is the exec. Master at arms, hi. Admiral Nelson is in sick bay. He is, as of now, under arrest and to be confined under guard until we reach Pearl Harbor. Sir. Do as you're told. Aye, aye, sir. See that it's carried out. Aye, aye, sir. Kowalski. Sir? Riley. The flying submarine. Is it in operating condition? Yes, sir. Damage control made the repairs. Good. Prepare for immediate launch. Uh, I'm all right. Just to, to get back to your post. shoot him down. Yes, sir. If you ask yourself why he didn't stay shot, 
I've been asking myself a lot of questions lately. So far, I haven't been able to answer any of them. Well, I've got the... the answer to some of them, but getting you to believe them will be another matter. I'm listening. Lee Crane is no longer Lee Crane. What are you really saying, sir? Crane's body has been taken over by Captain Crook. If you say so, sir. If you've got to believe me. I believe you, sir. Please relax. Oh, good. We know each other pretty well. Been together a long time. That ought to mean something. Yes, sir. Will you do just one thing for me? You know Crane as well as anyone. Just talk to him. See if you can convince yourself that he's the man you know. Will you do that much for me? I'll do that much. Lee, you can't take off enough flags, so now you just got out of sick bay. I've got to be in Pearl Harbor before you get there. Why? Top secret. I'll fill you in later. Now you take command. Surface and head for Pearl Harbor at full speed. Did you say surface? Naturally. I want you to get there as quickly as you can. Now what are you staring at? Don't you think you ought to speak to the Admiral before you go? With his condition? Why? We got you. something I've got to know. Don't go. Come back. Come back. You've got to, to get some rest. Now, if you can't quiet down, I'll have to give you something to put you out of here. No, I, I don't want anything, Doc. I'm, I'm, I'm all right. I, Are you sure? Yeah. It's just, I was just having a bad dream. I'm, I'm fine. Fine. It's fine. All right. Get some sleep. Yeah. to surface because we could make faster time up there, I knew something was really wrong. Every man who's ever served aboard a nuclear sub knows they make better time when they're submerged. But the commander of a World War I sub could easily make that mistake. Now, don't you see, Chip? This confirms what I've been telling you. I don't know, sir. I can believe almost anything except the idea that Kruger is in Crane's body. Then how do you explain Crane's actions? He's out of his mind. He must be. Before he left in a flying sub, he was wild. Wait, that proves my point. 
Crane can fly that craft. A subjective from World War I sure couldn't. Well, conditioned reflex is all that proves. Crane's body could fly that in his sleep. As a matter of fact, that's almost exactly what he's doing. Maybe. I can convince you of anything. I've got to convince you of this. I was forced to do it, practically compelled to pull that trigger. Compelled by Kruger. But, sir, how can you expect me to... Oh, no, no, it takes a little getting used to it, but in time, you'll see. Our job now is to find Lee and free him. Free him somehow from Kruger. Oh, he could be almost anywhere in the world. Didn't you get a fix on the flying sub when it left? Yes, sir, but we lost it somewhere in the South Pacific. Oh. Yeah, it's not much, but it's something. Ship, we've got to make a move. Now, if you're willing to take the chance, let me go back to my cabin. There are some charts I have to study there. We could start with that. Look, you've got to do it. You've got to. All right. You give the orders, I'll carry him out. But I've got to post a guard at your door. Good enough, Chip. First thing, reverse course and head south at flank speed. I'll have you released. Man, am I beat. How much longer is this watch? About 20 minutes. I gotta get some sleep. I've got a big night planned tomorrow. Honolulu. Navigation is the exec. I want a 180-degree turn. Proceed due south, flank speed. Due south. All ahead, flank. Aye, sir. What do you say about Honolulu? just as you told me. Where are you taking me? Don't be afraid. Come with me.
a burial ground. Let's get out of here. So there's nothing to be afraid of. Please, let's move on. Now that I have the one thing I have fought so long, so hard to get, never. Lani, I am here. I have returned. What's the matter with you? What's wrong? It was all for you. A form, as I have. I have traveled the world to find the right one. A body that will let you feel the warmth of life again, as I feel it. Do not stop me, Lani. Please. Stop me. I will stop you. This is wrong. You do not understand. Let the living stay with the living, and the dead with the dead. No. I have planned too long. I will not be stopped. I will stop you. You are helpless against me now in that body. I forbid you to go on with this plan. Lani, Lani, look. Look, she is perfect. The moment I first saw her so long ago, I knew what I had to do. I searched for a body for myself. When I found this one, I knew the plan would work. I went to her again. I brought her here. Lani! Where are you? Lani! Come back! Lani! Where are you? Lani, come back! Lani! Lani, where are you?
Captain Kruger is on the island of Malayo. He is there now. Many years ago, Captain Kruger came to Malayo. We met, fell in love. Then he went back to sea, swearing to return. That vow has kept us both in bondage all these years. Malayo is deserted now, except for the graves. I will always love Captain Kruger, as he loves me. But this island holds him to earth, holds us both. Go on. Destroy Malayo. But why? Destroy the island, and our souls will no longer have an earthly tie. But, but, but Crane. First, you will get him off, Malayo. There is a girl there with him. You must save her too. Then blow up the island. Search for the flying sub still negative, sir. I suggest a change of course. No. Uh, come on over here, Chip. Take a look at this. Molayo. We're right in those waters now. I want you to heave two off the coast and I'm going ashore. Yes, now. These coordinates are target. I want you to get a missile ready for firing. Or would I give you word by short wave, you fire that missile. Understood? Believe me, Chip, you're doing the right thing. I'll get started on it right away, sir. Stand by with a wrap. I thought the Admiral was under arrest. What goes? You heard the orders. He's going ashore. Extra ready with the rafts. Got it, one. I'll let you know when to fire the missile. Ah, right, sir. Good luck. against me. Is it? You're real now. A physical body. You have talked to us, Lonnie. That's right. You can stop a bullet now, Kruger. 
I will be back. I will find my Lonnie and be back. Then none of you will leave here ever. Lonnie, you must listen to me. You must listen to me. Give me a hand. You want to save your life and his? You've got to get him off this island. Nelson, to see you. This is Morton. Go ahead, Admiral. We've got Crane. That's in exactly five minutes. Fire the missile. Nelson, to see you. Nelson, to see you. Coming, Chip. Chip. It won't work, Admiral. for Lonnie. I willed her to come and I'm stronger than she. Get to her before it is too late. 